Hi, I'm Mayor Rick Kreisman, and welcome to StatMap. This interactive tool displays the locations of citizen requests, including those submitted to our Mayor's Action Center and via C Click Fix, as well as the locations of code case investigations and police calls for service. Keep in mind, the data you see is simply the information you've provided to us and has not necessarily been confirmed or validated. And not all police responses result in a crime or a report being written. This video is an introduction on how to use this new tool and answer questions like, where are citizens requesting city support? And what is happening in my neighborhood? MapStat starts with the whole city showing citizens' report of c -click Fix for the last two weeks. You can look at individual requests by simply hovering over the pins. Click on the pin for more detail. This brings up the pins bar. Here you can see trends of reports for the time period and categories. Click Compare to see reports for the previous two weeks or whatever the time frame you filtered by. There is also time of day, day of week, and clicking on a specific time and day will narrow the pins on the map and the list below to the selected times and days. Multiple days and times can be selected and by clicking them again clears the filter. The bar also shows the detail of the pin or pins selected. In C Click Fix, and code case reports, you can click a link to bring you to further detail on those items if desired. Now if you want to look at a particular area, you can either use the map tool to select a neighborhood or council district. There is also a list feature you can use if it is easier for you. Clear out the selection by choosing it on the bar. You can also type in address, I'm typing in City Hall, and then choose exactly how big an area you want to look at by using this tool in the corner. Say you want to look at the month of November. Enter in the dates or select on the calendar November 1 to November 30th and you would like to see all the reports for that area for C-Click Fix, Codes, and Police Calls. You just click the check next to them to select. You can also select only a few items in each of the categories by clicking the check and then clicking the check next to each item you would like to place on the map. You have selected the area to watch, the time frame to look at, and the items to map. You can now save it to your favorites and go back to those filters the next time you select it in your favorites. You may also want to be alerted via email if anything changes in your selection. You merely create an account by selecting Create Alert and clicking on Sign Up. You can enter your information or use another social media account to sign up. Once the account is created, sign in and click on Create Alert, and then an alert can be added. You name the alert and select how often you receive email notifications. If there are any additions to this area and items you selected, an email will be sent where you can click a link to take you back to the map to see it. The final feature of this tool is all the data that feeds this map is available for downloading or viewing. Click on this link and you can select the data set you would like to view or download. We encourage you to continue exploring this tool and the data it holds. It is the first tool in the St. Pete Stat program and we're looking forward for more to come.